Hey everybody, how's it going? It's The Daily Shooter, and I've got a really interesting review for you guys today. Now, I live in the high desert, very close to Mojave, California, and it seems windy out here like every single day. Last weekend when I went shooting, it was 35 mile an hour sustained winds with gusts over 50, and not only is it difficult to shoot in that kind of wind, but you're also getting pelted in the face by sand and little rocks and pieces of plants, anything else the wind picks up. And it's just difficult to shoot. I mean, it's difficult to go out and have a good time. So when I got home from shooting, I hopped on Amazon. I picked myself up something for seven bucks. And honestly, I'm thinking this might be the best product that I've ever bought for seven dollars. I'm really happy that I have it. There's a lot of different names for it. This uh, is one that I bought from Millspec Monkey on Amazon. And I suggest you guys uh, check it out. Again, this is uh, by Millspec Monkey. And people have different names for these. Um, bandanas, uh, buffs tubular bandanas, whatever you want to call it. I'm just going to call it a tubular bandana because as you can see it's one solid piece. Uh, it is a tubular de uh, design. It is a bandana of sorts that you can do a bunch of different things uh, with and it's really nice. It's a stretchy flexible material and uh, it's definitely going to help me out. I know there's a lot of you that live in really windy uh, environments just like I do. Uh, desert environments, places where there's a lot of sand and debris that can be picked up during the wind. Uh, and something like this I think would definitely help. Now I have to look up the different ways to use this because uh, similar to if you guys have ever seen Survivor and the buffs that they wear this is very similar to that. You can use this as a scarf, as a face mask, you can put it around your wrist and I'm going to try it on to show you guys a little bit more about it. But this one I thought was a little bit different. I didn't want to go with like a standard black skull super black tactical type look. I wanted something that kind of uh, uh, looked cool still, well, went with my gear and a little bit more of the desert environment, but just something a little bit different. So Millspec Monkey on Amazon, I'll put a link to this in the description box. It was free shipping, seven bucks, and uh, I think it'll help me out a lot. Let me try it on real quick. Okay, so here it is on. You can see that with the tubular design, you're able to actually pull this up over your ears, so you're protecting your ears from the sun, from the wind. Uh, you can just leave it out like I have it here, or you can tuck it into your shirt, tuck it into your gear, whatever you want to do. Uh, and it gives you a lot of coverage. It's very stretchy. It's a very soft material. So it feels nice on my face, um, you know, especially with the beard and everything under there. You need that stretchy material. So uh, instead of holding like I was holding a rag and stuff over my face when the wind got too bad and there was dust storms kind of coming through, uh, I won't have to hold a rag up to my face anymore if I'm using this. Uh, it does protect the back of your neck as well. I mean, if you pull this up enough, and I'll turn around here and tuck it down. Uh, this will also protect the back of your neck, so while you're out there shooting, sunburns, things like that, uh, this is going to be that little bit of a protective layer. It's definitely good to have this face coverage. I mean, especially in wind like this where it's just absolutely out of control and it's like this on a, on a daily basis, definitely get yourself a good face covering. This one for seven bucks and free shipping, you really can't beat it. Now something else that you can do with it, and I know there's something like 300 different ways you could actually wear this. Um, you can wear it as a beanie cap, things like that, but another way you can wear it is just as a scarf. So on cold days or even hot days, if you want to drench this with water while you're out shooting, you can drench this with water, help keep you cool, keep the sun off your neck. Um, if you want to use it as a sweatband, you just take it around your arm like this, wrap it around once or twice, and then you can use that as a sweatband or just to, to have on there just to keep things dry. I mean, you can use this to uh, cover your optics. Like I said, there's ways to fold it as a beanie uh, and different, different things like that. But uh, a lot of them that I looked at uh, were nice, but they, you know, I've even seen some in motorcycle shops because I dirt bike ride constantly. I'm always out there uh, riding either, you know, quads, two wheelers, uh, side by sides, and we're just out having a good time on the quads. And, uh, I've never had one of these before, but uh, my wife has one that's similar. It's not as comfortable. It's uh, got kind of a neoprene top and then the same bottom. I really like this design right here. So uh, again, definitely check this out because if you live in a, a windy environment or even you just want to conceal your identity, I mean, something like this is also going to be good for concealing your identity and uh, just, you know, overall face coverage. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and you guys have a great day.